picks the altitude when I go flying? Well, it starts out with dispatch. Almost everything begins there. And so the dispatcher is the first person uh, that sends out an altitude. And they'll look at all the weather and all the ride reports, and they try to pick the smoothest altitude and, of course, the most fuel efficient uh, altitude to, to fly from point A to point B. But most of the time, once we get airborne, the captain or the pilots decide on what uh, altitude they're going to take. It's a collaboration then between air traffic control, who might need you at a different altitude because they've got crossing traffic, and where you want to end up being based on how much fuel you have and maybe some shortcuts that you can take. Sometimes they'll ask you to climb a thousand feet for crossing traffic. Sometimes they'll just give you a turn to the left or the right. I prefer to climb if I can, but there are certain limits on how high I can climb based on how heavy my aircraft is. I'm the only one that knows that. Dispatch is kind of out of that picture once we take off. So they start out with the initial altitude. I tweak it as we go based on the ride and the efficiency and I, in a collaboration with ATC. Now you know, I'm Captain Steve. Fly safe. Wait, don't go yet. Do me a favor, become Captain Steve's new best friend. Hit the like button. Uh, share and subscribe.